Bubba Box Truck Corey. Hello, YouTube. Welcome to my bathroom. We are starting a 30 day no shower trial in preparation for van life. They say on, the, on YouTube that you don't need a shower. So I thought before I move into my built out box truck, I should find out. So what I did is I, uh, I, I demolished my shower. It's, it's gone. Gonna renovate this bathroom, so I figured, hey, why not tear it out early and, uh, you know, put myself to the test because, you know, it's hard to, to try this 30 day no shower thing if, if you actually have a shower right in your apartment. So the demo is pretty much done. It's now open concept right through to the kitchen. If anyone comes over to visit, they have to be, well, they just can't like their privacy too much. So we're going to start out with, uh, with some pure glycerin soap. And we'll see how that works. And I'm just going to, you know, use the sink here to wash. And, you know, I'm, I'm pretty optimistic. You know, people, you know, they didn't have showers for a long, long time. Found a little uh, antique wash stand here. I can uh, show you how they... They would have did it a hundred years ago. This is like the full, the full deal. They even have the pea pot down below. So they, uh, you know, they had the little bar on the washstand for their towel. You know, the pitcher for water, the bowl to wash in. I think, I think that was for soap. Not certain. And I don't know quite what that was. Did you put your antique toothbrush in there? So, we're going to embrace the old way. I'm not sure how it's going to go. And if they don't need a shower, you know, back in the day, then why do I? So, we're going to give it a go. This is day one. And I'm going to check back with you guys every week. And I'll let you know, uh, know uh, what, what I've come to realize, my thoughts, any pointers I have for you, and ultimately whether you really need a shower. Well, I will see you back right here in my bathroom one week from today. Well, we're back in the, the bathroom here. Thank you for joining me. It's been a week and I've, I've had some problems. Let me, uh, let me show you. You see this, this glycerin soap. I like the natural products. I don't want to put chemicals on, in me or on me, but it's, uh, it's very liquidy and it just, it just doesn't lather up. And You can you can see a little soap, but it it's just not doing not doing the trick. When I start scrubbing the body, it's just it's no lather. It's just not not soapy enough. It's not not doing a good job. So I uh, I tried this. I bought this. Live clean. It's, uh, I thought it was natural, but it says on here, 98% uh, plant derived. So that, I guess that means it's 2% poison. You know, if it's only 2%, it's fine, right? But I don't, I don't really like it either. So I don't know. We're going to give it a go for the next week. And see if it does any better but this this is just not getting lathery enough to do more than hand washing 
So we'll see. We'll see if the live clean does the trick. You know, it's it's foamy. That that's good. It you know it. It looks lathery. I, I'm optimistic. You know. It, well, we'll see. I'll get back to you one week from today. We'll start week number two. But for now, tip number one, watery glycerin soaps do not work well. See you next week. Well, here we are again, back in my bathroom, sitting on my toilet. Got my comfy sweats on, got my slippers. You know, everything's doing great, except for this whole no shower thing. I really want a shower now. It's been two weeks, this whole washing in the sink thing, having trouble. It's, uh, it's not what I thought it would be. But this, this live clean stuff, it's not cutting it either. I'm having the same problems. Like, uh, you know, it, it does say, foaming hand wash, not body wash. So maybe I need like a more soapy soap. Cause you know, I'm getting a little, you know, crotch rot. I'm just not, it's just not working. I need, I need a better soap. So I don't know. I'm either gonna find a better soap or I'm gonna give up, but so far, I'm a little disappointed. It's just harder than I thought it would be. Simple thing. Like I've heard people on YouTube say that they don't like the wet wipe situation and it doesn't, they don't feel clean after. And I'm starting to see why, because like, you know, it's nothing like a good hot shower. So, I'm a little demoralized. I don't I don't really know how this is going to end up, but I'll check back with you for week 3. We're halfway there at least, but halfway, man, better get better because I think I think I'm just just not clean enough. I'm just not I don't know. Kind of stink a little bit. So I'm going to try again. Find a different soap. Maybe that'll be better. Wish me luck. Well, back in my favorite spot. Sitting on the throne talking to you guys. I have some great news. I've had some success. Let me show you what I'm talking about. We even have the dogs come to visit. It's getting pretty crowded in the bathroom here. Does daddy stink? Are you gonna leave? So I picked up some of this. This, uh, this, this Nature Clean body bath bar soap. And it's working really good. I'm really impressed. Let me show you how this stuff lathers up. I'll to rub that around a bit. Can you see? Lots of soap, really good lather. I'm happy with this stuff. It's been working real well. Look at that, awesome. Never thought I would refer to soap as awesome, but when you don't have the benefit of a shower, and you're just using a washcloth, oh, the lather, it's so important. I really like it. Nature Clean, got it on Amazon. It's working out real well. No complaints, love it. Gonna get some more for the six months on the road. 
heading out to the deserts of the southern U.S., getting away from the cold here in Canada. And uh, now I have my soap. You know, it, it only took me how long to figure it out? Three to four weeks, three weeks I tried it, but we got it down now. We're good. We're golden. We can hit the road. Van life, here we come. But I don't want to just tell you it's good. Let's demonstrate. I'll just get naked here for you. Get right in there with the bar, lather it up. Got lots of lather on the, the washcloth. This is great, guys. This is awesome. Look at that pit. Have you ever seen so much soap in an armpit? This one's going to be good, too. We'll wash that one up, but, you know, you don't need to watch it all. Works good down there, too, ladies and gentlemen. Just so happy. Never realized how happy a bar of soap could make me. Almost not quite as happy as a real hot shower. Well, we've got our month in. Just wrapping things up. Got my towel. Got my nice little... Uh, red PJ bottoms on and I am ready for a shower a real proper shower now this soap the bar soap I'm pretty happy with I really like it I would I would recommend that